Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Addie, and today I'm going to be doing a wish list. So basically, I have some things pulled up on my Pinterest. I have a notebook full of a bunch of stuff. Christmas is in like four months, so that's literally crazy. It's July, I believe, so I don't know if I did that math right. Anywho, so let's get right into the video. So I know like this is also something that I would want. So I put a lot of my personal preferences on here and then I put a lot of things that are popular, but you know, Christmas is still in four or five months. So there's a lot of new stuff that's probably gonna be coming out. So yeah. Also, this is a little bit new of an editing style and a videoing style. I actually have a ring light this time. I'm trying to get better quality um, videos out and this is the room. I just posed for my thumbnail and now we're gonna get into the actual video. Number one is blankets. I think I took blankets for granted when I was younger, but oh my gosh, they are so good. So these are some photos of blankets that I would recommend. The next thing is sugar scrubs. I like to take showers a lot. So, you know, I like to obviously stay clean, whatever, after I work out or something. And a good sugar scrub is just always nice. Now, I know Tree Hut is a popular sugar scrub. So that's probably gonna be your best option for something when you're looking for them. Like when you're, is like one of the most popular sugar scrubs. I don't own one, but trust me, I would definitely take one if I could get one. Okay, number three is lip glosses. Or, okay, number three is lip glosses or lipsticks or basically any kind of like lip product. I know there are some lip scrubs and then I know lip gloss and lipsticks, obviously. My preferable preference would be a lip gloss. I always love lip glosses. Literally, right by me is this one. Don't mind that I got it from Timu. We're not even gonna talk about that, but just how I roll. No, like Rare Beauty and Sephora, they have a lot. I have to make sure I'm not buying stuff when I save these pictures. They have a lot, and then there are also some really cute lip glosses for like um like designs on the outside of them, so not just clear, but like there's also pink and yellow and blue. What else? I know some people like more like a poppy color, some people more like a matted color. So you know, it's really just whoever the person is. Okay, so I think this is number four, but this is crocheted stuff. Um, I love crocheted stuff. My sister got me something crocheted. She also crocheted a blanket somewhere back there, and I think this is so cute. It can go on a desk. It can literally just go in your backpack with you. Like I love crocheted stuff. I get copyrighted. I hope I don't get copyrighted. Please, YouTube, don't copyright me for putting pictures on a screen. Because last video, I used music that was trendy, but I used it from CapCut. By the way, I had it on CapCut. And I got copyrighted, and that was not fair. It was not fair. Also, oh my gosh, this is a new top I got. It's so cute. I know this. I'm so obsessed with it. And I'm gonna wear it to use some week, but it is so cute. Okay, so number five is hair clips. I love a good hair clip just to like claw it up or something. Um, like, bam. I don't usually wear them just because of curly hair and it's harder to find a hairstyle to put up like a claw clip to handle curly hair. So I don't use them but I know a lot of people do so those are just such a great gift and there's a lot of cute style ones. Number six is skincare. I try using bubble skincare for a while but I think when I'm older I'll probably be a skincare girly and a makeup girly but right now I'm not quite one mostly because I can't afford it too because I um, can't afford it. But skincare is obviously a good thing. Try to go for things, if you are gonna get them skincare, try and go for things that you know they already have because if you get them something brand new, they might be allergic to it, etc. Just to have like passed that up or something. So just kind of like you can ask them, but if you don't want to make it obvious, maybe ask your relative what they have and you could get them that because you already know they already use it. So, yeah. so for number seven, it is gonna be so like self hair, self care, self. Okay, for number seven, it's gonna be self-care tools. And for this, I mean, kind of it goes more into the beauty as well. So, and there are a face roller and this, then I think it believes it's also called a gua sha or something. It goes like on your jawline. Sorry, be real. If the camera moved, it's because be real went off and I had to, I had to take it like, come on guys. Anywho, for number, for number eight, we have shirts. Now, something like this is what like, obviously i wear so i'm not gonna i'm gonna put a bunch of stuff that i believe is cute sorry there's a tree out of my window blowing i think there's a storm coming um i've looked at this shirt a lot hold on it's this top one i've looked at this one a lot and i just haven't bought it yet because i can only find it on timu don't worry for my girlies who aren't allowed to wear crop tops or cropped 
shorter shirts, I got stuff for you too. Obviously be aware if the person is not allowed to wear crop tops versus like, you know, like letting them wear longer shirts or something. So here are some inspo ideas if they are only allowed to wear longer shirts. Favorite mascara. I feel like makeup product is a big thing. Just know what they like. So like the big things I use is lip gloss, mascara, and blush. So obviously just go for their favorite things. And y'all, gifting does not have to be expensive. Okay, here's my quote right here. Gifting does not have to be expensive because it's not about how much it was. And if your friend only cares about how much it was or your parents or your sister or brother, get rid of them. Yes, get rid of them. That was so, that was so inspirational. So inspirational. Okay, anywho. Um, if they have a sport, I play volleyball, but I used to be a dancer. So if they play a sport, I'm gonna do, do three here. So I get to do cheer they do volleyball if they do dance then you can get like something like a keychain or something because it doesn't really matter if it gets a smaller big guys it does not matter guys this is taking me to sites i don't want to buy this stuff what is that it's not working so i know okay so i put the point to there but obviously if you know that they do jazz hip-hop ballet anything other than point i know ballet and point are similar but um Go ahead and get that, because if they don't do point, then there's really no point in giving them a point shoe. I believe that was number nine or 10. Okay, so for number 11, we have paint. Um, we do canvases or like different art things. For number 12, I'm gonna go ahead and do bows. It depends on the person's style, but if they don't like bows, I would get them as hair bows like this. But I mean like, if I was to put my hair back like this and just put a big chonky bow in it, that's what I'm talking about. Again, I wish I wore bows, but I don't own any, so good luck with those. So something that I do, which is a, as a hobby, and I actually have a business, by the way, it's called AB Designs on Instagram. Um, AB Designs 1, right there, so if you want to go check that out. Okay, I made a horrible mistake, and I've been downloading everything to my to the computer's camera roll and I can't send stuff over to my phone so I can edit it. Yes, I edit on the phone and that was so rude. Okay, anyway, um, so I'm going through everything. Thankfully, Pinterest has a saved little thing that I can just press back, 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 back. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys got some cute gift ideas and remember to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Bye.